This is all just some sort of sick, ludicrous joke, right? Didn't you hear the audience chanting? <laughs> I think it was quite clearly not a joke. Seems his noggin's a bit dense. <laughs> I can speak for myself, thank you very much. Long musical number short. I am rebuilding the Nazi empire in a new nation. What country would be stupid enough to let you goose step your way across their borders and plant your Nazi flag? Perhaps your dear director, Cynthia Houston, can answer that. Now, the prince of the new democratic republics of old... Oh, fuck it. He's an inexperienced, inbred, tumbo doofus, and all the great painters feel the same way. That doesn't leave this room. Where did that come from? A little birdie told me. That little birdie being an advanced network of information surveillance that we've been developing. Boring! Are uh, you fucking asked? <laughs> now that I am privy to the little secrets world leaders say behind each other's backs, I plan to use it to my advantage at the World Peace Gala in Geneva. Tomorrow night, the deadliest man will kidnap the idiot prince and hold him ransom with the added threat of blowing up their nation's capital with the bomb stolen by our dear Tatiana. My God. When none of the great powers come to his aid, I will sweep in and offer them a helping hand. It is then that I will rise as their new Fiora. Oh, <laughs> sir, sir, <laughs> don't forget about your advanced Nazi super castle. Yes, yes, yes. Even if we don't blow up the capital, they're going to build a new one. This, a castle, on a special plot of land picked out by the deadliest man himself. A very versatile bit of soil it is. Perfect for rebuilding an empire, sir. It, it's also a landscape rich in natural minerals, like silic... Yes. Yes. <laughs> this one still counts as mine. This guy sure is a powder keg, huh? Good thing he's working for me. I knew I couldn't trust no, you to trick. No, 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 no. You're not getting in her head this time, Mega. She's my girlfriend now. No, I'm not. Who knows? I've had you under my thumb for this long. I thought I was free Heidi after this Berner, was over. prepare my bedchambers. Tatiana, prepare the bomb for transport. Mr. Deadliest Man, please show our guest, to his death. I shall await my cheeseburger in my bedchambers. Cheeseburger, eh? Sounds awfully American. Well, those are the perks of being the Fuhrmega. You get to eat whatever you want, and you get to eat it in bed, okay? <laughs> like a big boy. I'm a big boy, okay? <laughs> Goodbye, Mega. <laughs> Uh, you sure know how to get in the people's heads, Mega. But oh, it ain't gonna do you no good. We're getting in here. I'm a steel trap of secrets that would blow your fucking mind. Help. <coughs> We're not gonna just slip by with your cocky demeanor this time. I'll see to that. But before I chop you up into my carry-on luggage, I'm gonna torture the living shite out of you. I've been waiting for this moment for such a long time. And wouldn't you know it, you're finally mine. If you're erring, please show it. Don't be afraid to cry. And just for my enjoyment, you will suffer, suffer, <laughs> suffer, <laughs> until you die. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I cried the evening land. I cleared up your schedule, nowhere else to go. Trust me, you're in. Master of torture, it gets me high to show you the horror of staying alive. I'll prod you and poke you and bleed you dry, and just for my enjoyment, you will suffer.
Can't you see how much I enjoy this? I'd never avoid this, cause body, I'm a different breed. Huh. This is my calling, and though it's appalling, I love making people please. I once was a spy, but I won't be a spy again. At least I try, try to fight till the end. I don't need your help. I don't need anyone's help. What's your damage? 